what the Fisu called, you know, the tier two or the tier one and a half of junglers. And I think Evelyn is good because it's good against unorganized teams because one, they're not used to playing against it, and it's really hard to back the three lost by a camping bottom. Um, but they're going on the bot lane here. Adi gets caught. No, respect flash. That's a flash away, but an instant flash into Pulverize and head, but the lantern pulls Andre backwards. The chanted arrow stops Niels for a second, but that's first blood to the newcomer on the stage. Here comes Whirlip. He slams him against the wall. They get frozen by the prison, and that's two kills to Giants, but there was a report, a reply teleport from Soaz. He's put down the equalizer, 2v3, looking for Niels. He didn't find a target. Amazing, however, has found Godfrey. Gonna keep running him down with those hate spikes. Soaz does not have Equalizer for a few more seconds. The Lantern Ooh. pulls Audrey backwards, but the Pulverize knocks them both up. That's another kill to Origin. Amazing's on the board. The Flame Spitter puts Soaz on the board. Three kills. We do see Whirlip as well as Frederick in this middle lane. But Mithy is a little bit out of position. He's actually not oh, Whirlip back. We do see Niels has joined the party. Whirlip with a defensive knock. A knock up from the uh, Fates call. And now Whirlip is chunked down from the ring. The Ash Arrow comes out. It does land onto Mithy. He's going to be falling to very prey in a second. No, he's still alive. He manages to hit, but the minion may use it to cut off Giants on the side lane. He does, in fact, do that. Maybe a little too far away for the rest of Origin to respond. Niels is looking forward. That's a flash into Dark Binding. Audrey catches Soez up, but the Spitter is still burning him away. Agony's embrace is melting Giants on the side lane. It's a two for one as the Glacial Prison locks up Origin. A flash away from Godfrey. He's trying to survive, and it looks like he will. Frederick Ooh. is going to face plant into Pekka, and that is going to be a three for one trade. Stylistically speaking, Giants is, gets carried by Pepe Nero, you know, and then they just build to shut him down. If he's not doing anything, he is 1-1-0 one, one, and zero right now, and Pekke, he's having the time of his life. Well, let's take a look. I'm expecting an arrow here from Audrey. This one flies out. It does connect onto Mithy as he re-emerges from Fate's Call. So this is not back, which stunned up by Whirlip. Now we see Mithy finally forced to flash away. They've dropped Whirlip's now, and Pekke is flashing forward with the Soul Shackles. The Rend plus one more spear is enough to get a kill, and Niels almost dropped by Pepe Nero, but almost is simply not enough. Amazing runs him down, and that's three kills. To just deal so much damage. Oh, they, they're getting contested on the back. Uh, that's that's very brave. He's got caught. He's got knocked up. Will it arrived, but... They have no idea where LeBlanc is. She could flank, and this could be good. Well, let's see if they can. Niels has already used the QSS. He'll now pop. Flash is still available. Pepe Nero has found him. Giants have got one of the main damage dealers away from the fight, but they do lose their support. Now Amazing is the next to fall, and Frederick, he manages to survive from the Equalizer. Mithy knocks him back, delays, tries to keep himself alive a little while longer, but it's Giants that find three kids. Same thing on the other side of the map because of the dragon timing, and Origin's buying into it. All right, let's see what they can do. Pekka's got caught down. He lands Ooh. a dog Finding, and instantly, Pepe Nero is down. 5v4 now, as we see Frederick Four on the retreat. Evil Glacial Prison has been used, and Whirlip has got not a lot of options to throw down that Gnar. He does hold on to it for a while, knocks him into free space. There's no stun. The Ash Arrow finally, but again, it's too little and too late. And Origin, CPEC is surviving the trade. So, Baron Empowered Minions on the bottom lane. Mithy going to get caught by those Ethereal Chains. is amazing as looking to set up a flank. So as is put on a very early equalizer. This could be just distraction while they secure the tower. Three members of Origin flowing forward. The Glacial Prison does absolutely nothing. Niels is able to scare away Frederick as he flashes over the wall. So tower secure. Piling in on bottom every wave. Super creeps. Amazing is looking out for the long flank. Well, we do see Pippa Nero lands right in his head. Mithy flashes forward, gets the knockup, headbutts him backwards. Amazing. May go down. The Ignite is burning. We did see the inhibitor turret falling. Amazing was killed by Ignite, but Godfrey is traded in return. Ash Arrow connects there onto Niels, but it simply does not matter. Frederick is killed on the front line as another inhibitor now falls. Origin have taken out super minions, uh, inhibitors in the top and the bottom lane. Three members of Giants are down for another 30 seconds, and they're committing to the Nexus turrets. This is going to be the final push. Yeah, good resource manager, management water there from Origen. They basically know that they can put two people on Pepe and still win the remaining 5-3v4 because they're so far ahead. Nice fight, clean execution, only seven kills, eight now away, but they're getting the Nexus and they're taking a first game in the European LCS. Origen!